Hello, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the series Using Python to Solve Java Problems. In this video, we will solve another Java programming exercise found in the book of D.S. Malik, Java Programming from Problem Analysis to Program Design, 5th edition. Chapter 1, Exercise 16, page 24. Suppose A, B, and C denote the lengths of the sides of a triangle, then the area of the triangle can be calculated using the formula square root of S times quantity of S minus A times quantity of S minus B times quantity of S minus C, where S is equal to 1 half multiplied by A plus B plus C. Design an algorithm that uses this formula to find the area of a triangle. What information do you need to find the area? You now we need to know the values of A, B, and C. And based on the algorithm that I have provided here, we will follow that. So number one, get the values of A, B, and C, and we can accomplish that by asking the user to input these three values separated by comma so here is our code for that so the length variable will be a list and we are going to extract our values from there and convert each values into a computable number All right so a b and c now we need to look for the value or compute for the value of S, which is uh, one half times A plus B plus C. So here's the code for that, which is the same as A plus B plus C divided by two. Now we are ready to compute for the radicand. And to get the square root of that, we will use a function, mathem mathematical function of Python called SQRT but we need to import that library first so put it up here okay so we have our import we have our input convert the input we have computation to get the S we have computation to get the radicand and then we get the square root of the radicand. Now let's run the code and let's see 3 comma 5 comma 7 and we have the area of the triangle as 6.5 and that concludes our video for today. I hope you have learned something as I have learned many things in this video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell to get updates on my upcoming videos. See you then.